because I'm gay now. Hi Fruits, I'm back. For my last video, I asked you guys to send me tweets on your heart stop of the dick. On your heart stop of the dick. <laughs> For my last video, I asked you guys to reply to my tweet with something to help me shut these kids up. One eternity later. For my last video, I asked you guys to reply to my tweet with your season two Heartstopper predictions. In that video, I asked you guys if you wanted me to do a part two within an hour of me posting that video. The clear answer was yes. So I put up another tweet this morning and now we're gonna read the replies. Considering how hard it was for AJ to think of a reply, how funny would it be if I didn't read theirs? I love you, AJ. I'm gonna read AJ's first. I feel like they'll kill me if I don't. The room situation in Paris, I think Tao will start arguments or give dirty looks directed to Gnarly because of the two beds. In the comics, he has no idea still about them dating and wanting to share. So I'm intrigued to see what happens because they don't share, of course. It'll obviously be interesting to see if they do share or not, now that Tao knows that they're together. But I don't think they will. I mean, they do on the last night obviously because Tao stays in Elle's room, so does Alid, but Alid will be replaced by Isaac, I assume. So I'm intrigued to see the bed situation. I'm going to bash my head against a wall. Don't move into a council estate, guys. I don't know, but we're all talking about things that happen in the comics, but what about the new scenes like sports day? I have no idea of what it would be, but I just know Alice would have come up with some cute stuff. I agree, this show is based off the comics, not exactly reenacting the comics. So I'm very excited to see the new scenes that Alice comes up with. I feel like there will be a few. Sophie says, I hope they will talk more about Isaac being a race. The representation is very important and I've never seen it anywhere else. Alice has come out and said, this was before the show was renewed, that if there was to be more seasons of Heartstopper then, she'd definitely look more in depth into Isaac's character, him being on the a race spectrum. I definitely agree agree that that community needs more representation because if it wasn't for social media I wouldn't know that it was a thing. The only aromantic character I've ever seen is Raphael in Shadowhunters and even then the term aromantic isn't used. There wasn't enough representation with him because he wasn't a main character so it'd be a good thing to see Isaac have a big part in season two. Now we're gonna read Ash's tweet. Ash was the one with Nick makes up towel hit him with a ball. So let's hope Ash has come up with something better. This is better, I promise. Right, so I think the first scene of season two will start with Nick's journal entry, but as a voiceover and there'll be a montage of Nick and Charlie moments they've spent together when they walk into school together, being out and proud with Tara and Darcy, and then Colours of You starts playing. I'm a genius, I know. That'd be really cute. I know that uh, season three will probably start with Nick's journal entry considering Charlie goes to the hospital. It'd be good for them to interpret the journal idea into it because I feel like for them to have the journal entry come out of nowhere for season three wouldn't really make sense. So they need to definitely put, I'm really sorry, there's a pigeon, they're shagging. <laughs> that was quick. Where's your endurance? Lame. But what was I saying? <laughs> they should definitely include journal entries in the background. It'd be nice to have Kit voicing over what has happened the past few months, but I feel like that will happen in season three at the start when there's a time jump. It depends how much Alice manages to fit in season two and where season two ends. But if season two ends where Charlie is speaking to his parents about his mental health, then I think season three will pick up with a voiceover. If not, and we get a season four, I am adamant that season four will pick up with a voiceover of Nick explaining. The flies back. He's not going to explain that. <laughs> of Nick explaining that Charlie has gotten to hospital and why he's gone to hospital. <laughs> Somebody found Bald Kit Connor funny. Icon, icon, icon. Don't laugh at Bald Kit Connor. Bald Kit Connor deserves rights, okay? I'm going to start protesting for Bald Kit Connor's rights. I pledge allegiance to the flag. Lilith said, more Isaac being a race, hint. 
I agree. I'm very excited to see the AI race representation through Isaac. Alice has already said that there will be more representation through Isaac. And there are people outside that really need to shut up. I'm sorry for the background noise. I cannot do anything about it unless I want a murder charge. Ma said, Nick speaking in French and Charlie being like, how did I not know? And I'm so excited for Saha being a girl boss as always. Me too. I'm so excited to see Saha. Within the next two weeks, we should probably why are you screaming? Why can't I film a video? <laughs> Nick speaking French, I'm very excited to see Charlie's reaction to that. It made me laugh in the comics, but that also brings Nick's dad into the series because obviously it's when he's on the phone with his dad. It depends how they play that out, but I'm very excited to see it. More Isaac and an episode focused on Mr. Ajay and Mr. Farrakh. I saw this article about Alice saying there could be a possible spin-off focusing on Mr. Ajay and Mr. Farrakh, which I would live for. So I don't think they would do an episode focused on them, but if they did, then I'd love it. But I really hope that they're at least a backstory in it. And more Isaac, yes. I'm very excited to see Isaac. I'm very excited for Toby to get a big part. Charlie said, I think people will be gay. Ew. I don't know about that one. That's gross. I'm trying so hard to entertain people and the Wi-Fi is just not letting me. This entire video is probably going to be me yelling at kids I don't know. You just call me a-